Well, if you live in Lima or visit here on any regular basis, you've probably seen Terry Watson. He's the energetic young man who can be found outside Little Caesars Pizza on Cable Road or Bell Fountain Avenue. But there's more to Terry than you might realize. In today's OIO in the Community segment, we bring you a special story produced by Lima Community Church. Here's Jonathan Berkey with more. You may not know his name, but Terry Watson might be the most recognizable figure in Lima. Anyone who has driven past a Little Caesars in town has seen the man with the agile feet, the spinning sign, and the thousand watt smile. Even from afar, Terry's happiness and positive attitude are infectious. Closer up, and you realize it's a miracle that Terry is even alive. I'm grateful to God for the gift of life, and I shouldn't be here. On Terry's 10th birthday, Terry's father turned violent toward him and his best friend. In the attack, Terry's best friend was killed and Terry himself was severely injured. He spent months recovering in the hospital. I didn't have any feelings in my feet or my legs or my hands. For Terry, the rehabilitation process meant starting all over. Everything was like different processes because you had to learn how to talk again, you had to learn how to walk again. So I'm practicing all these. So I was like, oh, so you walked? I was like, yeah. <laughs> and they put me on the belt and let me start slowly walking. Today, after a long recovery process, Terry is the dancing, smiling face of a franchise, and his gratitude comes from knowing his gifts and talents are not his own. It's not me that creates the joy, but it's the Lord who creates the joy, and I'm thankful for it, for real, but he gave me the joy and the gift of my moves. Whoever said I have like that. <laughs> What an incredible story. Mm -hmm. Who would even stop to realize that about this guy who just purveys happiness yeah. outside of the pizza place and what a background in his life. Yeah, I think one of the interesting things is, you know, we saw the video, he, he's got the earbuds mm -hmm. and he, he's listening to praise and worship music. And, you know, some of us maybe have come from a background where dancing was frowned upon, but the fact of the matter is, we know that David danced for joy, mm -hmm. that any tools we have that can bring glory to the Lord we are to use those for his, his glory and honor. That's certainly what Terry is doing. Joy of the Lord is my strength. And he certainly shows that. And on Facebook, he calls himself the president of smiles because he <laughs> is always trying to invoke joy in other folks that he knows comes from his Lord and Savior. Yeah, he actually goes to my church and uh, he's a dad and he comes to church and he's got that same praise attitude when he, you know, when we're singing. Mm -hmm. It's it, just never stops. It's always there. The happiness is always there. And how neat to see how God saved him from that moment when he was 10 years yeah. old, protected him, and you know, and now he's he's impacting people yeah. every day in a positive way. Absolutely. So so far.